For over a century, the English school has welcomed boys and girls through its gates. This year, we invite you to join the long legacy of students who spent their years here finding answers and solutions to questions big and small. Today's question is, what does it mean to be an English school student? For over a century now, the English school has welcomed students from all over Cyprus and beyond. This video should help you make the choice that you want to be one of those English school students. The English school has an unrivaled record. Academically, we are without doubt the strongest school that there is in Cyprus. The reason for this is that we have exceptional teachers, exceptional students and parents who support their children at every stage of their learning. At the English school, you, you will not only learn facts, you will learn how to think, how to solve problems, how to discuss and how to debate. There are many things within the English school that we are proud of. We are proud of our students who graduate from some of the most prestigious universities in the world. We are proud of our history, we are proud of our staff, our students and of our alumni. You will find when you come here that the support that you will receive from your teachers, from fellow students, will shape your future. So in seven years time, you will be a leader. You will not only be a leader within the school, you will be a leader in the local community, in the international scene, and you will become something that you have probably not quite believed. So at the English School, you will have every opportunity to grow in every single aspect of your own personal life. The school attaches great importance to providing opportunities to young people in leadership. The English school's history and legacy uh, across all sectors is unparalleled. The members of this community are of the highest caliber and the students here are self-motivated. They are confident, ambitious and hardworking and actually being surrounded by this environment pushes you to develop and become your best self. And once an English school student, always an English school student. What does it mean to be an English school student? Well, first of all, it's a sense of legacy, following through on parents' descendants' history at the school. It's becoming part of the worldwide old boys and girls network of the English school. My father was also here at the English school a few years ago, which makes me proud to follow in his footsteps. Because my mom was part of the school, and I always wanted to be part of the school ever since I was in primary school. My grandfather was at the school, my sister was at the school, my brother was at the school, and now my younger sister is at the school, which creates a huge sense of legacy. Um, grandfather used to be a teacher here and a student, and then my father came here, my brother. We are the oldest independent school in Cyprus, and with a long history stretching back 120 years. Academic excellence has always been at the forefront of our development as a school. The idea of giving a top international quality education to Cyprus's brightest children, whatever their background, in order to prepare them for the most competitive university courses and professional pathways. In this respect, it's worth bearing in mind that based on our yearly percentages of A star, A grades, at GCE level, we would be placed in the top 30 to 40 independent schools of the UK. Turning to IGCSE level, our students achieved an amazing 70% A star A grades, um, whereas the UK average for A star A is only 20.7%. There is no doubt that we are the top achieving school in Cyprus. But our school is also one of the world's top achievers. Just imagine, in 2019, 85.1% of our IGCSE math students achieved an A star in IGCSE maths examination. Still on the theme of high achievers, it is worth also noting how many of our students win national, regional and world awards. Some of our students last year were Haralambo Sakaria, who won the highest mark in the world for GC Greek. Emily Fuji Kiriakidou, who won the highest mark in the world for first language IGCSE Greek. And Bei Hong Lin, 
who won the highest mark in the world for IGCSE maths. Although we've always had a large number of students choosing to follow subjects such as medicine, law, engineering and economics at university, we do also have a good number of students choosing more creative subjects, art, music, drama, to name a few. English school teaching and learning processes are of the highest standard. Whilst at school we provide our students with support throughout the seven year journey. Our aim being to achieve visible progress from every student in every subject. Support is provided by fostering a strong sense of belonging through excellent teacher-student relationships, a supportive and caring learning environment and by being sensitive to students' needs in order to ensure that the best of learning takes place. Another very important source of support are our teachers who are selected carefully and who are highly qualified and knowledgeable. Much of the teaching and learning in the classroom relates to the development of skills, especially critical thinking, applying concepts and knowledge in unfamiliar contexts, and improving both writing and oral skills. Coming to the English school, I didn't feel stretched and challenged enough. However, everything changed when I joined the school. The teachers always push me to be as good as I can, and I feel very supportive. To support the students further in achieving success, we have in place robust target setting and assessment frameworks. Following assessment, students are guided towards improvement with constructive feedback. Homework is assigned daily in all years and there is a regular schedule of quizzes, tests and common assessments which is consistent from class to class and from subject to subject. Many departments offer students individual support sessions as well as planned support sessions after school which means that our students have no need of any additional support out of school. Teachers are always accessible to me I and mean, I can find them after school, I can send them an email, I can send them a message and they can give me feedback. Teaching and learning are facilitated in an environment that is conducive to learning in newly built and renovated classrooms which are air conditioned and heated, equipped with technology and with wonderful displays of students' work. So the English school provides an environment which is conducive to learning. Our greatest asset being our people, specifically our teachers who care and help every child achieve progress and maximise their potential. What makes the English school number one? It's not just about academics, it's about excellence beyond the classroom and that's where extracurricular activities come in. There are currently close to 30 activities open to students in years one to three. Impressive not only in number, but also in the quality and variety of the activities offered. As a first year student, your child will be guided towards choosing activities by their form tutor, as well as the teachers in charge. Our activities for junior students are inclusive and open to all students without audition or tryouts. Last year I didn't have any activities when I was at middle school. Now I have almost every single day an activity just because of our friends. I really like math and it helped me develop my skills in math. And also every Friday as a junior girl I participate in the games which are athletic activities and this all helps us learn each other better and socialize. As students progress through the school, activities become more challenging, more diverse and even more rewarding. Just to give you a taste of some of the activities to look forward to. In recent years, our celebrated debate team has travelled to Australia, South Africa and Hong Kong. This year's Thailand delegates went in January to the prestigious Hague International Model United Nations. Later in February, a group of drama students enjoyed all that London's Theatre C has to offer, while our third and fourth form Spanish students attended language workshops in Madrid. Honestly, I can't pick one that I prefer over the other. Um, throughout the last seven years, I've been involved in debating clubs in Medimun, EYP, Thaimun, choir, orchestra, councils. I feel, like, I feel like these activities have really helped shape me into the person that I am today gain confidence and whenever I'm on stage I feel like it's my home. I go to Greek Debate Club where we debate about different running topics all around the world. 
We also learn how to support an opinion with reasonable arguments, even if we don't always agree with it. We also go to the school's science club, where we do many fun experiments and we learn a lot of interesting things. As much as we look back at our traditions with pride, we are also innovators and pioneers. To give you an example, we were the first school to introduce a non-competitive talent night and this year we held our 25th annual performance to a packed theatre involving over 130 students from years 1 to 7. We were going to audition for talent night uh, to uh, year 1 students and I got the opportunity to be one of the presenters in the talent show and that was an amazing opportunity. Um, I, get, I got to work with the older students and all teachers and it was a really amazing to perform on stage. Astronomy, I really like astronomy and I want to be an astrophysicist when I grow up. So uh, I go to the astronomy club and there are many other people that have the same interest and sometimes we go to field trips to Xiliados or Mazodos. We are also the innovators of the Mediterranean Model United Nations Conference, a rigorous and relevant leadership activity hosted by the school every year in February since 2006. Another central part of extracurricular life at the English School are the many charity initiatives which take place all year round. These include NGOs such as Hope for Children, as well as student-led fundraising and service projects proving that our students are caring, active members of our society. We in the Erasmus Exchange Program, which is a two-year program that involves schools from various countries, which focus on a specific subject and do different projects on it. I was fortunate enough to spend a week in Finland, where we presented our project on the five most important rights to us. It was an amazing opportunity and an unforgettable experience. One of the activities I took part in in year two was Hope for Children, where it, it is a gathering of a few people and we talk about children's rights and refugees that come up from all over the world to Cyprus. Um, refugee, children refugees who don't have parents and they come by themselves, don't know anything about this country, not the language. The founder of Canon Newham back in the 1900s could have envisioned the activities of the 21st century. The new Eco Schools project our thriving robotics club, Formula One in schools, Junior Achievement Entrepreneurship Program, European Youth Parliament, Japanese language and culture, and let's not forget Zumba Fitness. At the English School, we take music very seriously. There's always music coming out of classrooms, rehearsal rooms, at breaks, in the evenings, even on weekends. We have over 100 students currently taking instrumental lessons here at school. They take lessons in a variety of styles and a variety of instruments, of course. Some of them do, um, work on orchestral instruments, such as the flute, the oboe, the violin. Some of them take lessons in contemporary guitar, drums, and vocal singing. I have been passionate about music for as long as I remember. I was born and grew up in London till the age of 12. When we relocated to Cyprus, I wanted to find a school that not only excelled academically, but also in music. Despite the fact that I had changed country, left my childhood friends behind, my school and the Royal Academy of Music, I felt totally welcomed by the English School. Welcome to the PE department uh, of the English School. Uh, the school uh, and the PE department have a long history and a long tradition of sport, uh, beginning with the founding of the school and uh, kind of new and bringing actually football, cricket and hockey to Cyprus. Uh, so the school is where uh, it all started. Uh, we've maintained that tradition throughout the years and now we offer sport to our students uh, three levels. Uh, the first level is our normal physical education classes in the morning, whereby our students uh, are exposed to a variety of sports. The more traditional ones of uh, football, basketball, volleyball uh, and some uh, sports uh, that may be new to a lot of students, like softball, uh, field hockey, uh, athletics, uh, and many others. The second level of sport at the school is afternoon games. Uh, this takes place uh, once a week in the afternoon, as the name suggests, for our students. Uh, and there, the structure is slightly different. Each student belongs to um, a house, a team, and they actually take part 
representing the house and not the year group. So uh, they may uh, join forces with uh, older students uh, to participate in competitive and recreational sport. And the third level of sport at the school is the elite level, uh, the best of the best, uh, the athletes, um, the top athletes of the school, they can join our school teams whereby they will play sport against other schools, both private and public. The qualities and the, the experiences that I've gained by being involved in sports are invaluable to me. They taught me the importance of uh, perseverance, of teamwork, of leadership, and they've shaped, formed me and shaped me into the Georgia that I am today, and the Georgia that will be moving on to the States. School is always supportive when I need to be absent for competition. Dear parents, congratulations on your child's success. This is a big day for both you and your child. You have invested many hours in preparation for these exams, so the good news received are a celebration of their efforts and your support. You must be very proud. Our pastoral team of form tutors, heads of year, assistant heads, and subject teachers are here to make every day an exciting journey. We offer support, encouragement, and care. My form tutor is organized. She's a nice person. She always comes in the, in the class with a smile. The school has supported me both academically and emotionally because of all the supportive teachers and you can talk to them about anything and also the school counselors which will help you with any problem that you might be facing. We strive to develop the children, helping them become empathetic, world citizens, lifelong learners and adaptable to the changing world. I came from a Greek school and I thought the transition would be very difficult, but that was not my case. Um, all the teachers were very welcoming and also they supported me academically and emotionally and they supported me and helped me fix my mistakes. Our initiatives help the children smoothly transition to the English school by building bonds with their peers and their teachers. Some of these initiatives include our Jubilee trip, induction day team building activities and pastoral educational trips. Uh, before go to the Jubilee I was shy. Uh, I, can't, I couldn't speak. The school being attended by a large number of students inevitably means meeting a lot of people, which leads to making a lot of new friends. You'll be surprised how quickly and how fast this is. One of the keystones of life in our school, and the number one priority for every member of the community, is the well-being of all. Every member of staff is trained in the skills and knowledge required for the safeguarding and protection of every individual child whether it be their physical, emotional, or mental well-being. This includes a zero tolerance to any form of harassment or bullying and a rigorous program of personal, social, health, and citizenship education, which offers students important life skills. Every member of the school recognizes that safety and well-being are essential in helping each child grow and mature. At our school, we welcome children of all backgrounds and embrace diversity and uniqueness. We are here to support, stretch, and challenge our students in a safe and caring environment. We have a zero-tolerance approach to bullying and teach the children to treat each other with the utmost respect and stand up for what is right. At school, during our PSHC lessons, we have a lot of presentations about anti-bullying. And I think all the students understand that it is a zero-tolerance policy. So if we ever do have a problem, there are many ways which you can report it. You can always talk to our farm teacher or our head of year or any person pastoral. And there are also tip boxes which we can place an anonymous note and we know that we're going to get help. We look forward to welcoming your children to our school in September. Boys and girls, we can't wait to meet you and embrace you into our English school family. See you soon. So I hope that you really enjoyed the uh, operating insight into the life and work of the English School. Uh, it's very important for you to know that we have a team here that is dedicated to making sure that when you join us in September that everything is ready for you. So not only a team of myself and the senior management of the school, all the teaching staff, all the support staff, and probably most importantly for you, the school, the English school students. My name is Georgia, I'm head girl, and I'm proud to be an English school student. I'm proud to be an English school student and the respect I get from everyone around me. Um, I'm very proud to be part of this excellent school 
uh, everyone here is amazing, the teachers, the students. I'm proud to be an English school student because of the inclusive and supportive community where everybody excels in their respective field whilst also supporting each other once we're on the outside world. I'm proud to be an English school student because as arrogant as it may sound, I truly believe I'm at the best school there is.